modular system. SACMI provides its expertise in order to realize this kind of project to lead the client through the digitalization path. The final aim is to create the perfect product that better fit the client needs. Now we are going to concentrate to the modules that provide the production management. So the digitalization of production not only speeds up the automation process, but even increase the efficiency, reducing the human intervention and hence the error due to that. So now we're going to see, we know nowadays how, nowadays how much is important to establish a communication between the ERP system and the process in order to control the whole managed system. So ear can be connected to all enterprise system uh, in order to establish a communication and it can be connected as well to all machine, all the new and third part one to allow a bilateral communication. Thanks to this communication, ear can provide the control for the whole production life cycle, uh, taking care, for example, of production plan based on ERP orders. So now we are seeing an automatic batch tracking in which an operator has to communicate the, a new batch has started in a continua or in a press. Now on, the operator will have no longer to communicate nothing to ear because ear knows exactly where a batch is and thanks to that it can load automatically the right recipe on the right machine at the right time. And all these constant, uh, constant monitoring, of course, provide a lot of control. And here provide the possibility to have the current situation available at a glance in a real time of review everywhere you are. So all these constant monitoring in order even to provide the to better figure out how the, your plant moves, ear computes a lot of indicators such as a cost indicator, key performance indicator, and all the other typical indicators of ceramic process based on data he receives from machines. Now, all this constant monitoring and as well the computation is worthless if you cannot be notified about that. So you can choose to be notified on whatever is important to you such as if something happens during production, if something has been assigned to you, and so on. For example, if you have a warehouse managed system, you can be notified from here uh, about the storage level, about the finished product quantity, and so on. Having this kind of integration lead to create a link between the production and the logistic. And this can control a lot of different process areas, such for example, the labeling, printing, the shipment, and so on. Having this kind of uh, management, having this kind of integrated data, allows you to have a deep and concrete analysis of how your plant moves through a digitalization of report. The aim is to create a real, reliable data collected with paperless support. At the end, with the scheduler, we can provide not only the production plan that we've seen so far based on ERP, but it ensures the optimization of requirements, raw material, production plan, based on some optimization parameter that you can choose about, such as the quantity of storage level or the availability of resources. So now we're gonna see a timeline that represents an example of step. Uh, the first one is the also called step one, is a basic system, a really entry level in which a client can start to work and then we will increase it time after time in order to achieve the goal that we have prefixed.